Hi guys, Fun with Baby Alive here, and we have baby Sarah here. She is the baby alive that came with this little rocking chair, and I don't think I have ever made a video with her except for collection videos. So I thought we would do a little feeding with her and probably a changing. So this is a changing and feeding video with little bitty Sarah. First of all, I'm going to make her some food and then we're going to feed her and of course we'll have to change her diaper. So she is really pretty. She kind of has like brownish eyes, but they almost, they have a little green in them too. They're really pretty and she has molded hair, but just a little bit on top. She is really cute. Here you go, sit in your little rocker while mama makes you some food, sweetheart. <laughs> She's so sweet. This is this little t-shirt she has, adorable. I have a little bowl and a spoon and a bottle of water. I also have some banana apple food. So what we're gonna do today is I'm going to pour some water in the bowl. And I'm not gonna make her a full batch of food because she won't eat very much. So I'm just going to pour just a little and then I'm going to take the food and shake it down like this, tear it open. Yummy! I'm going to pour not all of the packet because I can use this packet to feed her several more times. So what I'll do is just kind of roll this over like this and then I'll save this to use later. So I'm going to take the spoon and just kind of mix up her food and this will be plenty enough for her. Hey baby girl, are you hungry? He's so hungry. And then I let you see her food. Yummy. This is a you and me bib. I got this at Toys R Us in a little accessory set. It opens like this so I can kind of just push it onto her neck. And this bib is really good because it has this little pouch down here, so if any runs out of her mouth, it'll go down in the pouch. So I really like that. All right, baby girl, are you hungry? We have your food, and we're gonna feed you. <laughs> Look at her, she's like, just hurry up and feed me, mama. So we're gonna get a little bite. Here you go, baby Sarah. <sighs> Want some more? And it's harder to feed the babies that are drinking wet dolls. So what we do is we get their bottle. I got her a bottle full of water. And then I just kind of give her a drink to help wash the food down. I usually give her a drink in between every bite that we feed her because that way she doesn't get stopped up. She's not really supposed to eat baby alive food, but it's fun to feed her anyway. <sighs> there you go, baby. If you wait, you can kind of watch the food go down. Then I give her a drink. Good girl, you are such a good girl. Is that good? She loves it. This is her favorite, the banana apple kind. She's not much on the green veggies, but I try and give her some sometimes. Here you go, sweetie. Sometimes I'll give her two bites between drinks. It just depends. Messy girl. All right, you got your food. You want some more? Here you go. There you go. Mmm, that was good. You want a drink? Isn't she so cute? I just love her. Oh, <laughs> look at her. She's so adorable. You're adorable. Isn't that good? See it going down? You can kind of see the food if you look in her mouth. It's getting further in. Let's give you a drink. And I usually like squirt it two or three times after I give her a bite. See, she drank a little bit of water. You gotta be careful because she's wearing a Baby Alive diaper and they don't hold very much, so 
If she drinks too much water, her diaper will start leaking everywhere. Does that happen to any of you guys? There we go. Oh, it's hot running out of her mouth. You're a messy girl. She's such a little princess. You're a little princess. Mama loves you, baby girl. There we go. There we go. We got a little bit more. Try to eat your dinner. There we go. Whoop. It's running out sometimes. If her mouth's too full and I put the bottle in, it just squishes the food out. This is why these bibs are good. Look at this. You can see it running down into her bib. You are one messy little girl. But believe it or not, some of this is getting in her. <laughs> She's like a typical baby. Sometimes they get more food on the outside than they do inside. Aw, oh, baby girl. Are you messy? And the last drink I give her, I usually give her an extra couple squirts because I want to make sure she's cleaned out really good from all this food. Otherwise she could get clogged up. She's drank almost all of the bottle. Is I have the little Sesame Street Big Bird wipe container and I'm going to get a wipe. We need to clean your little face, honey. <laughs> she's so messy. Alright, let's wash your little face. Aww. She fights it sometimes, but she's being really good. It's all in your neck. You're a messy little princess. She's doing so good. Look at her. You're being a good girl for mama. Alright, let's take your little bib off. And I'll show you guys how much food got in there. Look at all that. And if you wanted, you could like dump it back in your bowl and feed her again, but it's gonna be extra runny because of the water that came out too. But these bibs are really good. I highly recommend them. And like I said, I got this at Toys R Us. It was in a You and Me accessory set. And I love this bib. It's probably my favorite bib that I use for the babies. And it cleans right up. You can just wipe it off. And her clothes are all clean. Take her out of the chair and I'm gonna look. Hopefully she didn't overflow. Oh, she didn't. Look, there's just a few little drips on her chair. I'm gonna move her out of her chair. I think her shirt did end up getting wet. <laughs> it's okay. Maybe we took your bib off too quick, huh? All right, now I'm, I'm gonna give her just a little more to drink just to make sure she's cleaned out good. There we go. And I'm gonna take her little shirt off so that we can make sure it doesn't get any dirtier while we're changing her diaper because I have a feeling her diaper is going to be really bad. You are sweetheart. Look at that. Aww. I love this little shirt on her. Okay, we're gonna check her diaper and I have a feeling it's gonna be atrocious. All right, baby girl. Here we go. Oh my goodness. These baby life diapers do not hold very much. It feels really wet. And I think a lot of them were too old for dolls. So she had size two diapers she was actually using on her baby live. And I've seen several of you using size two. And it seems like it might hold more when they go, so maybe you can feed them more. Is that the case? If that is, let me know in the comments, because I'm really curious. But this diaper is plenty big on her at a size preemie, so I can't imagine her wearing a bigger size, huh? I have these cute little socks. I didn't unbox, or I think I did a haul with these socks just the other day. But we're gonna put some on her. They look a little big on her, but they're really cute. They're zero to six month size, so she's a little smaller than the average baby, huh? 
I have this little onesie and it's a child of mine Carter's preemie size. I got it at Walmart in a three pack and I also did, I think I had this in my same haul, so if you want to see that. It's really cute if you want to see the print is like some little black hearts on kind of a cream color. So it's really pretty. And we'll set her up so I can put it on her. Come on, baby girl. You <laughs> big girl. Isn't she so cute? Let's get your little onesie on. What's up? <laughs> that was good. You did good. You did good, baby girl. Where's your little fingers? There they are. Aww. There we go. You're gonna look so pretty. You're so pretty. You're a pretty little girl. She's so cute. So cute, huh? This will be a little big on her, but she's cute anyway in it. But you cute on her. That's pretty. There we go. Oh, look at her. <laughs> Doesn't she look cute? I mean, it's a little big, but sometimes when the onesies are big, I'll just kind of take them and grab them in the middle like this and kind of fold this part down or maybe even a little further up. That way it looks kind of a little more like it fits them. And this is a preemie size onesie. It pretty much swallows her up. I wouldn't want to wear anything any larger on her, but it might work. And the socks are really big on her, but they're keeping her feet cozy, huh? All right. You want your rattle? You want to hold it? Can you shake it? You like that rattle? That's a good rattle. All right, give me your passy. She's so sweet. Let's put you in your rocker and we'll put your lotion on. I'm gonna put just a little. There you go. All right, let's rub it in. <laughs> put some on your little face. I love how this makes them smell. They smell so babyish. Here, let's take this out for just a minute. I know. Hold on. There you go. It smells so good. Oh, I love this smell. I actually saw online that they have some Glade plugins with this smell. I've never seen them in the store, but I thought about ordering them because I love the smell so much. It smells so sweet. Such a sweet smell. There we go. Rub some more. Let's get on your arms. I like to put this on her because it makes her smell so good. Makes her smell good, huh? Not her little legs. And your neck. Oh, she smells so good. Smell her. Do you guys love this smell as much as me? Or do you prefer the Johnson? The Johnson smells really good too, but Baby Magic, I think is my favorite. Let me know in the comments below what your favorite baby lotion smell is. Please give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already subscribed. Bye.